in this video i'm going to teach you how to connect keyboard to signal rgb it's a very easy process so make sure to follow along in general connecting your keyboard to signal rgb is easy but it depends entirely on whether the keyboard is supported or not so in short it is an automatic process as soon as you open signal rgb if it detects a compatible keyboard it is going to take control of it allowing you to synchronize rgb across it and other devices the important thing is that you have to cl close other rgb software for example razor synapse corsair iq logitech ghub and so on all of these software can conflict with signal rgb so, if you know that your keyboard is compatible but it isn't working, make sure that you close down most of these software. Usually, when you open Signal RGB for the first time, it is going to give you a pop-up asking you to close down specific processes that might conflict with its operation. If you want to check if a specific keyboard is compatible, just visit the website, click on Supported Devices and Keyboards. All of them are going to be listed here. So you can look for specific manufacturers, you can browse through the compact, 10 keyless, full-size designs, and find a specific one. If it is not listed here, then sadly there isn't much that you can do. They add these keyboards periodically, and if they don't have support for your specific model, I don't know of any workarounds that allow you to add your keyboard manually. It comes down to having the automatic process being done once they have your keyboard with support. So I hope I was able to help you. If this video helped you, consider subscribing. As you can see, according to our channel metrics, 83% of the people watching our videos are not subscribed. By subscribing, you can help us make higher quality videos. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one.